Welcome to another adventure of the Time Pressure Extreme Day Hiker. Today we are going to be hiking the East Fork Trail. We'll head a little bit down towards Shining Rock on the East Fork Trail and we'll, we'll camp for the night and then we'll, we'll go up towards Cold, Cold Mountain on the second night. So it's the three of us, Stella, Josh, and I, and here we go. It's a little moist, but not too bad. It's actually a lot easier without the poncho. This is where the trail crosses the stream. And there's a couple neat features here. Number one, there's a really nice pond. And there's a really nice flat area for camping. Do you think that's the spot? Yeah. That's nice and flat. Doesn't get better. Kind of a late dinner here, but. The filet mignon with bacon. So here we are in the tent. Dad's knitting. What are you doing, Josh? I'm about to start reading. What are you reading? Eldest. I'm gonna work on some coffee here. The Melita cup top coffee maker works pretty good. We did pretty good with the rain last night. Our gear stayed nice and dry, hung up on the tree with our garbage bags over our packs. Josh is still sleeping. How's that hot cocoa? Oh, it's too hot. <laughs> There's Stella. Morning coffee. This is what Stella does when you give her a doggy treat and she's not really interested. She's going to dig a hole and she's going to bury it for later. Well, she obviously did a pretty good job. <laughs> it's pretty good uphill here in this section. So, um, got some wild azaleas here, really pretty orange color, and we're still seeing over here, some of the uh, mountain laurels are still blooming. They're getting a bit old, but they're still pretty. Stella, what do you got? Sit, sit. Stella uh, caught a little dormouse um, hopping through the leaves. It'll probably get really wet from the ground. Yeah. The trail opens up nicely here. It's a nice little break, a little sunny, grassy area. It's like a little tunnel in the trees here. It's better than going through the bramble. Yeah. It is. So here we are, and there's a big tree that's been like uprooted by the wind or something. And, uh... We're just about to Shining Rock. Here we are. Yay! 
It's always nice getting here. Here. Hmm? Never enjoyed peanut butter and jelly so much. It's just a real pretty day on the shiny rocks. Just tell us a little mountain goat there. campers today. Gotta have your iPod, huh? How does the spring look? Not great. It's okay. There's water. <laughs> Maybe we should pump right there. Looks cleaner. Do you think I should brought the other speakers? No, I think these are fine unless you want to carry them. <laughs> yeah. I forgot the iPod in my backpack last night, so hmm. might as well just, you know. Yeah, not had it. Pretty nice view here. Here we are, right, about, right before the Narrows. Looking off the Stairs Mountain. And that's why they call it the Narrows. Huh? That's why they call it the Narrows. Another vista later in the Narrows. About to head down into Deep Gap pretty soon here. You can see Cold Mountain from here, but it's still a long ways away. Well, we've made it to Deep Gap. Everybody's hunkering down here for a nap. Stella looks pretty pooped. <laughs> Got my trusty hammock here. Reading my book. I'm trying to take a nap, Stella. Oh. The trail up the old mountain is pretty much just a trail up a mountain. It's a lot of work. Stella seems happy though. Here we are at the summit of. Cold mountain. Storm over there. That's where we came from over there. There's the narrows and stuff. And that's a storm coming up on the horizon. It looks like pretty heavy. So that'll be fun. So here's the benchmark. So we had a little rain shower and we, we kind of came out okay here, but now it's time for dinner. What do we got, Josh? We got uh, spaghetti with chicken breast mixed in and we got cornbread. Now the cornbread Delicious. is the famous double boiler cornbread. The tent's a little bit wet, but we're going to be okay. Okay, here we go. Spaghetti looks good and the cornbread really came out perfect. The uh, backpacks have been put to bed for the night. And so has the dog. So here we are at the Cold Mountain water pump. <laughs> the spring. <laughs> so it's called. It's not much, but it's all there is. And uh, there's enough water flow here to fill up your needs. This is the spring at Deep Gap. And uh, as you'll see, it's not much of a spring. You have to be kind of creative and you have to make a basin at times to catch the water. And here we are arriving at the trailhead at Camp Daniel Boone. So that's another episode of the Time Pressure Extreme Day Hyper Hiker. Hiker. <laughs> See ya.